What up guys, something really special here. We are going to be trying out some Banished. I have not played this game for at least two years. It was April uh, 30th of 2020. I do, however, have about 180 hours logged of this game. I've probably played through uh, four or five other expert playthroughs, but I haven't touched this in a long time. So if anybody hasn't played this game, this is going to be real special. So maybe you fast forward a minute or two and we can get into some gameplay. This is, you have the ability to manipulate how fast you can pause the game. You can strategize. You can, this is kind of like SimCity uh, in, in, in a sense. Um, they, you have to, have to actively gather resources and um, you just have little benchmarks you have to meet, like survive you know, 60 days or 100 days, um, get your um, community up to 300 people or 600 people or 900. But we're just going to load into this thing. Hopefully you guys can look up Banished and, and understand what it is. But we're just going to go in. I haven't. <clears throat> Hood Goodenville. Interesting. So what what map, what, what seed do we want? I think we want with a seven. So look for one that has a seven on it, hopefully here in a sec. Oh, we're getting unlucky. Let's see. Five, four, three, two, one. Man, you'd think that statistically it'd be one in... There it is. Okay. Uh, terrain type. We want mountains. I'm about valleys. That's fine. Large. Climate fair. Disasters on. Conditions harsh. Or hard. So hard means uh, four families small amount of, and you, you get no no uh, seeds for farming so you have to find different ways there's no there there's no orchards on this and there's no seeds until you can trade for them way later on so that's what makes this extremely difficult so we're going to go into this there's going to be some pausing at the start i like to 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 set down and and uh really look at my land for a minute and then uh and i'll, I'll be talking out loud when i'm when i'm going through this of what i'm seeing and you guys can start seeing me planning uh, this. Banished, you know, <clears throat> it's it's good to go in on low or like low difficulty, medium medium difficulty. You want you want to learn the game. You want to be able to actively make food. So if you look at this, we're going to pause the game and we're going to turn on a lot of the uh, like the event log. You can hope hopefully you guys can see this. I know it's a little bit smaller. We're going to turn on and I'm going to be I'm going to be moving my populations around a lot. And then we also you also really do want to go in here and um, <clears throat> You want to tweak your 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 values a little bit. So food, I always add a zero fifty thousand herbs um, tools. You might might go down just a little bit, especially in the early game. You don't want to use all your resources on making a bunch of tools. Um, I'll show you what guys what that is. What's this? I'm missing something. I think. Okay, so this is what we have currently. Those are the resources that we have currently. These are professions. So maybe we go professions. Man, I think that's a little bit small. But we'll see. Hopefully you guys can see these. Events. Resources. And then... Uh, i got to move the camera just a little bit. Just so I can see my screen. Okay, there we go. That's better. <clears throat> so there is a little bit of prep that goes into this. So these are your, so these are, these are your, um, these are your people. They, they, they breed male, female. Um, they make, they create more, um, at age 10, they're able to start. Um, <clears throat> I believe it's age 10. They go in and they can start making uh, kids of their own. It might, maybe it's 18. I'm not sure. I think it's really, really low, uh, uh, age that the game gen starts generating and being able to, um, create uh more kids so we're gonna go in here oh my gosh i haven't done this in forever 
So I like since we can't make since we can't make farms, we're definitely gonna need tavern, tailor, blacksmith, herbalist. We need food. So gather hut. It basically goes around. Oh shoot, I need to do this. I think it's R. There it is. Okay, so you see these things on the ground. There's there's uh, mushrooms right here. There's roots. There's all kind of stuff that you need to start gathering. And this is what's fascinating. We're actually gonna. So if you look at this, <clears throat> this this is your lifeline right here. You can fish uh, from here. You can you eventually uh, make a trading port here, and you can start trading um, firewood for other materials and seeds and clothing and all the stuff that you're going to eventually need. So what we're going to do is I know we have a clear area here, but we can't make, we can't make, um, a farm anytime soon. So we're going to throw down the ability to start gathering. Oh, I don't think, Oh, Oh, it does. Okay. So we need to look at here. So we've got firewood tools and potatoes. We have no, we, it, we don't start. I don't think we start with any, We don't have any iron or anything. Okay. So this is, this kind of changes things a little bit. Maybe we'll get our fur maybe we'll get our road in here first. So we'll get a road. Main artery. Like I like to have a <clears throat> a direct path. And I wanna build over here because I want to get um to be able to fish. But our supplies are over here, so we're going to have to stay somewhat close. So we're going to get a gather hut over here. Like, maybe like this. And then we need to start making houses before it gets it gets cold. <clears throat> so you need... They need some, they, every single one of these people need a house. So if there's four families, you need four houses. So we've got a place for food. It's always good to... We need a market, not a market, excuse me. <clears throat> uh, we need a storage barn. That's what we need. So we need to think about this. We got the place that we're going to gather from. And it's good to throw, you know, maybe now. So I know one, two, three, and then do that. Then maybe a road. So like we're going to put our storage barn, our storage barn right here. Because what we want to be able to do is leave some trees here so their food food still spawns inside here. I'm doing this a little different, but in the long game, I can come back in here and put houses in here eventually when this gets more dense and we can get some places for food or, or uh, start making farms. But we're going to go house, house. Maybe we go house. Actually, let's go this way. House and house. We'll go road like this. Our storage, our storage barn is here. And we'll go like that. So now we have some tasks for them. We have the gatherer's hut. And then so we can come up here and we can instantly allocate. Eight out of 15, huh? Builders. Okay, so that's builders. And then the rest of these have 15. Oh, so we have a bunch of kids. That's why. So maybe we go four builders. And so the rest of these guys... You can go collect. And so actually, now that we've got our roads all set up, so that's what I like to do. So we got our road set up. We can actually delete these. So we're gonna go in here. We're gonna remove this structure, all the houses, okay? And I'll show you why. Okay, now that we got that down, we need, we need to get a lay down area. 
So it's always good idea to get your stockpile first. So we've got we've got the the gatherer's hut. We need a stockpile. So maybe I'll make a stockpile like right here. We'll do stockpile here. And this should be in the I'm going to make this the same size as the tavern. So later on we can replace this stockpile with a tavern. Might be a little big but that'll be for the road. So right now we're just going to go and build our stockpile. So all of, so we're going to hit play on this. We'll hit two, we'll hit three, and all of our guys will start heading over here. And they're going to do the roads, which is fine. Roads is good. They'll start carrying all this extra wood and whatnot. So see how they're, they're starting to clear our little stockpile area. We want this up and running immediately. So now when they start clearing things out of the way for the other buildings, they won't take it somewhere where you don't want your materials you want it to land in a stockpile so now we're going to go back in here and get our houses get our houses our storage barn i think I think it was like this and then we wanted our gather hut and that was going to go right here so now we're kind of off and running with the important stuff so builders hopefully start clearing and we really need those houses up and running and then we need to get fish like it's it's vital, 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 important to get fish. You can sustain it during the when it when it gets cold out. Is basically what happens. So we can slow this down a little bit and see. We've got we need we need wood, so. We've got one house. Harvest trees. So maybe it's good to go like this. So we're going to take one. We're going to we're going to we're going to randomly pick lines of trees to remove. We're not going to we don't want a clear cut. Or it's just going to be too it's too much the food won't respawn. So we're going to selectively remove some trees that people can go out and gather. And not just completely slaughter all of the vegetation. Because we're using that vegetation to generate food. <laughs> so they're going to start. They'll start gathering. They'll start. So right now we have 12 tools. We have 8, eight clothing. And they're going to go get food. Like right when you start, everybody needs food. So this might have been bad just because we're so far away from this. We can maybe, maybe we'll just go like, well, we well that's the thing. We need our storage barn here and that's actually really expensive. See logs. So the materials are here. We just need the logs. So we got to keep track of time. So right now it's spring. Okay. So spring, we, uh, we have until fall. But, but with this build, with, with this, the way that this is set up, we can collect fish and, and uh, gather uh, most of our food all, all year round. So we'll speed this up just a little bit and see what they're working on. So they're doing roads. And hopefully we got some people starting to cl clear some trees. So they're clearing this. They're going to take the materials down. Oh, nice. Okay, good. Oh, yeah, that's one other thing. So we need to pause this real quick. One of the main things, ways people can die is they're cold and they die from freezing. So if they do, if you don't have sufficient clothing for them, they rely on going back to their house to get warm. So food, warmth, and disease 
uh, and fire are your main main issues that you run into on a gameplay like or on a, on the on this game. So we're gonna make a. Uh, this is what I was talking about. So you need to go in here and you I find fuel. So I guess we leave it at 200 for now. I know we have zero. We really do need to start chopping some wood. So we need a uh, wood cutting or wood cutters. And maybe we put that like over here. And the reason I'm going to put it over here is we're going to make wood cutting. We'll put wood cutting here. Actually, let's wait. Let's make let's let's make sure that we get these built first before I start planning any other buildings. So the house is 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 done. We need more logs. So laborers should be out cutting stuff down. Playing this on expert, you really do have to min-max this stuff. Like, there's no way around it. You have to, have to, have to always keep your guys active. Always doing something. If you see people, like, standing around and they're not kids, you're doing something wrong. You always need to be giving them something to do. Like, building. You see now all the guys are down here cutting down trees. The builders are taken. Oh, so this is built. Now we just need 30 more logs. So as soon as. So that's built. This needs to be built. So I think our the the trees that we've are all done. So we need to go in here and harvest trees. So we need to harvest more. Selectively do this. really really do have to min max this and I might I might just clear out a, a little area okay so we're gonna hit play and see what that see what that does because the builders are, are we have the builders to build stuff we just need more more uh, more deals and then okay so now now that the storage barn is built as soon as this is done we're gonna tear down so we're gonna pause right there you're gonna go into here and you're going to remove, we're going to remove this structure. So we're going to remove this structure. They're going to carry everything from there to this storage barn. So it's closer to here. As soon as this is almost done, we're instantly going to make a woodcutter's. Uh, where do we put this? So we got this. I guess woodcutters will go here. Okay. And then we're going to put another stockpile right next to it. My mouse has been acting up lately. We got that. I guess we'll leave room for... We'll make it like this big. We'll do that for now. Actually, we don't need it that big. Maybe we'll go like this big. Okay, and that's where our our cut wood will go. You need a stockpile right next to a wood cutter to put. Somebody will come over here, start chopping wood. They'll get the wood from either stockpile that, that the wood's at and then cut firewood. We're going to play this, and as soon as, as soon as this is built, we're going to make... I'll show you what we're making next. We're going to make the uh, forest lodge. We're going to put a forest lodge, like, maybe... Probably, like, right here. And what that does is it replants the trees. You oh, The most critical part of this game is to renew your ability to... Um, cut trees you need to be replanting at all times if you don't have trees you're not collecting food 
If you don't have trees, you're not making firewood. Okay, that's why I always selectively um, only took certain. See these, the the your your onions, your plants, and all that good stuff do not do not regenerate if there's no trees in the area. So we're gonna go like this, and we're gonna instantly come in here and assign. Let's just assign two people to collect food. So we've got two people collecting food. We're gonna put our labor our our builders down to three. And instead, now, we want to be, we need to first look in here. So we, we got to look at this. So we got to finish building this. So let's finish building this. Hopefully, they start breaking this down. Oh, nice. We did. And we got the fishing up. Oh, that's great. Oh, man. We're off and running. We already got fishing. Oh, this guy doesn't have a tool. So like I said, they'll come over here and get more tools. That's the next huge, huge issue that you run into. You need tools and we're already on the clock. We're already on the clock for tools. So we need to get a blacksmithing deal right now. So we're gonna, we'll get a black, we need to get a blacksmith. It needs to be like down here. So maybe we'll make it like right. We're gonna make it like right here. So what will eventually happen is we need a mine. So we'll get a mine. Hopefully we can put it somewhere. Oh, good. We can put it like right here. So the mine. So what, what our, our, our future plans will be is to build in here a little bit. We need a couple of houses over here. And maybe we build this way, even though there's a, a little tiny stream through here. There's a lot of resources over here, and this is where we're going to want our mine. So we go like, we're going to go like this. I don't think we can turn it this way. Unfortunately, this game, you run into these issues where how the, um, the mountains and the hills are generated. So you kind of screwed on where you can put very specifically the mine. So we're going to have to put the mine right here. Somewhere right in here. So I think it's going to have to be... So what you do is you put this down and then you make a road. Like we just know, or we're not going to do it because they'll come out here and actually build the road. But we know that we, we're going to eventually need the mine right here. So we're going to put the blacksmith. Mine's there. We need to put like the blacksmith like right here. So we're going to put the blacksmith right there. That's super expensive. A lot of stone, a lot of iron, and we don't have much of each. So as soon as the woodcutter, we need to get the woodcutter done. Yep. There's just a lot of stuff coming up that we need right now. Mainly, so it's still, oh, it's summertime now. So mainly we need to get... We've got two, we've got two people collecting food. So they're randomly running around here, gathering all these resources from this, 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 this hut. So we're at 101 food, which is fine. We'll see. It's always this first year on this expert playthrough is make or break. You have so many things you have to get done and the reason that it's so you it's so so vital we need tools you always like running out of tools makes you guys so much slower like obviously like there a fire could happen at any time but eight stone we can collect all this stone right here we can collect this stone right here But this is almost done. When this is done, I think we allocate one woodcutter. So we need fuel. We need one person working this. So you autom So this is what I'm doing. You automatically assign somebody here and they'll start cutting wood. The only issue is you need you need wood to cut. So once again, 
you know, it's very touchy with harvesting some trees. So, like I said, you don't want to cut down too many. We'll do that. We can do some from, like, right in here. We can do a couple in here. And then as soon as, again, as soon as, like, this, this is vital. This, where is it? The blacksmith is just stupid important. We have to have to get the blacksmith working before we want to, before we run out of tools. So we'll see how this goes. Right now we're making, we're making firewood. Or we should be. There should be one guy. So we, we're, we're slowly making food. And maybe, maybe we got to do this. I think we got to have a fisherman. I know we're, we're going to be, we're going to be cutting this really, really close. But they're going to walk, they're going to catch fish and then they're going to eventually walk over here and put it away. So see how they picked up all of our stuff and that that wheel cart is no longer there. Everything's in here now. So roots, mushrooms, iron tools, coats. I don't know where they put the also oh, tools are in there too. So you see that? Berries, mushrooms, onions, roots. That's 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 extremely important. And then having Well, there's wood. This woodcutter will reckon oh never not never mind. So we need We've got the we've got some of this stone selected and we've got some of this stone selected. So maybe we cut down a little bit on that and so we've got two people we got three people on food, one woodcutter, but they're not doing anything right now. We're just going to put them on labor. And you see now for whatever reason, they, they actually, we actually cut some wood. So these houses, we go to inventory, you can see what they actually have inside of them. So this has 22 firewood. This has 10. This has 71, fi 71 firewood. Okay. So we need to get our, our, the most critical thing ever is getting plus or in the positive on food and wood. As soon as you get those two things care of, at least your people aren't getting cold or starving. We have two builders. What are they doing? They're working on this thing? Okay. So we have a early, early winter. It's already cold. Okay. So maybe we cancel... No, nope. we can do the stone. It's fine. People aren't cold right now. Okay, we might be able to survive our first winter just because of... So we have food. Look at all the food. We have 350 food in storage. So maybe I take down one of my gatherers and just make make sure we get more workers. It's just... It's so important right now that we we just barely make it by this first winter. You can see we're still generating a lot of food. There's food all over the place that, that's still being generated. And as soon as we clear, we need to clear, start clearing. So they're starting to clear some of the trees. We're going to slow this down just a touch. Okay. And we're going to make a forestry. So we'll put, we'll actually put forestry like right here. So forestry is going to go right here. I know that's really far to go out here, but I think we do it. We need to do it. So forestry is going to get us some wood. Okay. And then we put, actually, I shouldn't be doing that. I need to focus on this and make sure this gets done first. So we're going to cancel that. We're going to cancel that, okay? And we're going to focus on just making sure that the blacksmith is up and running. Blacksmith before chopping trees. So 32 logs.
Like you really do. If you've never played this game before and you're playing expert, it's really, really important to to um, to do this. Like you need so many resources. But you don't want to cut too much down. You won't regenerate anything. Speed it up a little bit, see what happens. Like we really do need to get in the black for trees. And there's zero stone. Why is there zero stone? We just cut all this stone. I'm curious where the stone went. Still good on tools. I didn't build anything. Ah, I don't know. I don't know where all this stone went that we just did, but that's okay. So we'll collect all this stone right here. See what happens. So we've got wood. We got 20 wood, so let's get our wood cutter back. Okay. So now we have five laborers. That's really good. Plus our wood cutter. So you see that? They're starting to get the stone. So this is really bad. So we need it we need it we need to get this. We need to get this cut up immediately and get this house warm. So hopefully somebody's gonna go gather this real quick, and then hope. So two houses right now. So we're in we're in we're in crisis mode right now. <laughs> this might be a quick one, crew. Okay, so we need wood. Maybe we just go like this. I'm just gonna go and clear most of this. Oh, okay, maybe I'm gonna do it that way, and then cancel like two of them, maybe. Let play and see what happens. So we need somebody to collect this. So we got a little bit. So he, he put it in. He's going to take it to this house. So hopefully we can get caught up on, on, on warmth. So see he's making... See the one guy that's wood cutting... He cuts one thing. Oh no, okay, we got two guys wood cutting. Okay. Crisis averted. We just need we need we need to get caught up. So we're down to seven tools. We've got food. This still needs so this has wood, it needs stone. It has, oh, it has the iron. Maybe I had iron. Okay. So we've got to do this. Get this stone. We're going to grab this stone. And some of this stone. We need that blacksmith. Nice. Early spring. Okay, so we, we survived the winter, which is great. But now we need to pause this. So we still, we're down on food, huh? Now food 186. So we're good on food for now. Or still, we're just maintaining. But we need stone real bad. Okay. So we're going to come up here and do this. And then we need uh, wood. Harvest trees. Okay. All right, let's play. Let's see what happens. 
So one child, two children, three. Ch so four. Look at that. A bunch of children already. So right now we're at 16 pop. We started at 14. So we've gotten two new children since we started playing. So let's see. So we still need a ton of stone. So I'm going to take off the woodcutter for now. We actually have some in storage, 48 in storage. See, we're down to five tools. play out we could speed this up more maybe I'll do that so we got stone in there so we need a little bit of iron actually I don't see much oh that's gonna be an issue we need to see if we have any iron no iron at all huh there's iron down here. There's literally no iron close to us, which is not good. There's iron up here. So we're going to have to run all the way up here to get iron. Iron over here. Cool. Look at that. We've got 420 food, 64 uh, f firewood, wood. We've got stone. This is full. So stone, we're good on stone. Now we just lack iron. That's That will make this, and then immediately we need to... Uh, get this up and running. This is next. <laughs> so as soon as this is up and running, we're way... We're... we're We are doing way better than we than we um, than when we started. So we're gonna get a road here from the forestry lodge down to a stockpile. I could put a stockpile in here. Hopefully. Okay, blacksmith. Oh, look at that. Perfect. We're going to pause it here. We need a road. We can do it that way. We're going to do it that way. Are we? Or what's what's faster? No, that's why. Holy smokes, we made... Look at that. I didn't even realize we are making a mine. What in the hell just happened? <laughs> I suck. I suck so much at this game. Okay. That's where all of our freaking materials were going. Was over to this mine. What? Holy smoke. Well, I guess we got a mine now. I never deleted it. Oh my gosh. We were financing a mine the whole time. Wow. Okay. Oh. Rip. <laughs> we got a mine now. So now we can do... We can do iron and coal, huh? Do we want, do we want one guy? Well, we need to make tools. So we're going to go like this real quick. We've got wood. No, we don't have any wood, but that's what we're working on next. So we need to get this log. We're min-maxing this for now, and I'll show you we're almost, we've almost made it. 
sliding into home here. Our food, our food is off the chain, huh? That's great. Gather and a fisherman. We've got a little bit of iron stored. We just need wood now. As soon as that, we can get a blacksmith. So we have it. So we're going to turn on the blacksmith. And you can see he's making iron tools. Did we make the road? I think we did. Let's go like this. Let's make sure we got the road. Okay, we got it. See that? So you just can't. I, mean, I didn't cancel it. I just deselected. So we're good. So now, hopefully we get, if we can get up, like we need, if this goes up by just a, a couple, that's huge, huge, huge. So now the most vital, vital things have been caught up. This is the last one. As soon as this is built, that's great. If we have guys sitting idle, we need to keep them working. So we'll do get this stone. We'll get this stone. We want all the all the all the resources really close to us all gathered. Because that's gonna make room for planting more trees. So you see, look at he's already making tools before running out of tools, which is great. Oh man, we're off and running now. Maybe we put another guy on fish. I want to put another guy on fishing. Okay. Oh no, we're going to stop. Stop, 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 stop. 100% stop. So we've got four guys. So we go into like this. You don't want to you don't want to cut any trees. We want to plant. So we're going to take Oh, oh never mind laborers. Select the cycle through the citizens assigned to this profession. But that's How is it for? One, zero? I don't understand. I don't understand why this is zero. How many adults? So it doesn't, does it show? I have 10 adults. I don't want four laborers. It doesn't, it doesn't, they must have patched this. I don't want. I guess I just got to do it from here. I just can't I want this zero. It's so weird. It auto it keeps. Okay. So I guess you got to do it that way. That's weird. I thought you could put them at zero, but I guess you always have to have not woodcutter. We need forestry. Okay. That's what we need. So we're going to auto. 100% plant all the trees in the world we can. Replant, replant, replant. This is going to be our renewable resource from now on. That's all we want to do is be clearing all the rocks, all the stuff out of the way to replant uh, trees. So look at that. We've already got, we're going to turn our blacksmith off right now. So look at that. We have 16 tools now. So we want that away. We want this. We're going to re right now we're replanting way, way fast. And we might, we want another one of these. We want another forestry lodge. So you can see this is going to here. We definitely want another one. Like right here. So you can see they're starting. I don't, you can see they're starting to replant all the trees out here. This is exactly what you have to have to have to do. And then I'll show you guys how. 
so always be taking inventory so we still have some wood we have a lot of stone we have we have barely any so that's another thing i the next investment that we need to make is a quarry the problem with the quarry is look at this damn thing okay like it's just gonna maul an area so we just want it out of the way and and only use it when we need to Man, we could have probably put the mine right here. That would have been another good spot to put the mine. We're going to pause this. We got to do this right now. So we need houses. Some of these people are too old to be living in a house. So that's the next step after this is we need like one house. Maybe we put a house over here. Like basically what it, what the game does is it, it assigns um, citizens to the, the closest um, type of work. So if like we have a woodcutter and a forestry guy, it'll assign hopefully two of them from this house. But we want this close enough to there. So maybe we put it like right here. Let's put a house right there. That'll be our, our next house. We need the the thing that you're going to forget about or you don't want to forget about is this, this girl is 16. This boy is 6. This boy is 15. So this girl is 16. This boy is 6. It might be 16 that'll get assigned to this house and they'll instantly start generating more population. So we're going to do that. We're going to pause this right now. Okay, so our food's good. Our firewood's good. But we're still... I'm going to put one guy on firewood. We just need a little bit more. Because the, the issue that we're going to run into is is we're going to run out of clothes. They're, we're not getting any clothes anytime soon. This is 16 and 8. So we have enough for that house. Tools are good. Food is okay. We got two. Oh, we got two fishermen. So we got another born. Another born. Okay, good. So we're we're off and running. We're doing good. Stone. We got all of our resources. See, look at that. We just ran out of uh, fuel or firewood. So that's why we got a guy on firewood. We're gonna pause it right here, and I'm gonna start. Harvest that one. We'll harvest that one. Yep, we'll see what happens here. Logs are low. But we got four, right now we got four guys on planting. So this is the investment right here. Four guys nonstop planting until they can't plant anymore. This thing will just be so flooded with brand new trees. Cool, there we go. I'm gonna take our woodcutter. Down to zero, okay. Wooders, woodcutter's down to zero. Hopefully we collect some more trees, which we already assigned. This is the next thing, like I was saying, the next thing that we need is a hospital. 
Okay, look at that. It's 52 wood, 78 stone, and 32 iron. And this, if there's any, any, at any moment, there could be disease. So this actually needs to be centralized too. So maybe we put it like right here. You need to centralize um, where, like, where your hospital is, basically. So, like, we have to build this. Like, I just need to somehow finance this. But you can start to see we're planting a lot of trees. Lots and lots of wood. We'll come down here and start harvesting some of this. We'll do that line and we'll do like a line like this, maybe. Five hundred food. Still tools are good. You don't need to work the uh, mine until you really need it. We don't need any iron. We're not making stool, steel tools yet. And we don't have our logging efficient. So we made it through another winter. That's great. Now you can really see where the trees have gone. They've been walking over here, replanting over here. Like, and this is where the trees start growing, which is great. So you can see from the start, we've actually harvested a decent amount of our trees, but now we're getting them replanted. So I'm going to take like a little bit of a go like that. Go like that. Like selective clear cutting. So now our hospital is off and running. Our new house is off and running. This is replanting. Like you, these first year trees, these brand new trees, they're not going to make food. Okay. You got to wait till like, like they're almost the size of these trees in order for them to start producing food. Well, that's great. We got another house, which... We're probably going to need another one. So 17, 11. So we got an 11 and a 12 year old in here and an 18 and a 17 year or 18 year old and a 17. Yep. So it's hopefully as soon as this is built, this will be a new family making uh, kids. This is uh, already got a ton of stone. It might, we might already had all the stone for this. Let's, um, We just need so many more trees. We can't, we don't want to touch these. We want this to make food. So that's cold. I guess we go like that. We're going to pause this and then we're going to cancel removal of like these newer trees. Because what's the point of, of cutting down small trees? That's good. 20 out of 50. We got to look in these. 50. Oh, not bad. 57. 40. 17. And 14. Okay. So, oh, this one's running too. We're not cutting anything down. I just want to plant. So we're going to put our builders... 
We still got our herbal or our, our um, 12. I'm going to turn on a woodcutter. So with getting more people, it's more mouths to feed. So eventually, like we need to figure out more food options or allocate more people to fishing or to gathering. Maybe we go like that. Like it tells you, so a new child was born. So like you'd see, okay, a 12 year old and a 19 year old are in there. So it's a little different. It, it, it went a little different than I thought it would. Oh, this is ready. We just need some iron, huh? So maybe we'll collect a little iron there. There's a little bit of iron there. Okay. Oh, this is looking good. This is looking real good. See how dense the trees are now? Still planting. So I'm going to do a little bit of selective. We'll do that. Like it's pretty dense in here. Okay. This is, we're sitting sweet now. We're starting to plant trees down here. And we got food down here. Do we want a hunting cabin? I mean, I guess we could. Like as soon as we, if we see deer move into the area. Like that's what that's what they'll go after. I don't know. I think we're good for now. We gotta turn the blacksmith bla blacksmith back on. Low key running out of tools again. We've got wood. We're gonna turn off the wood cutter for now. He's been running a little bit. And we're going to actually turn the mine on. We'll put two on the mine. And then what we need to do is... We need to make a stockpile right here. So this stockpile... When they work the mine, they're going to have this... They're going to use the stockpile to uh, put uh, the materials that they collect from the mine into the stockpile. Got five tools? Nice. Okay, good. Actually gonna, so I'm gonna turn this one off. So zero there. And then Oh, wait. Let me pause this. I messed up. Okay, so that was wrong. So this would be... this. That's how many you can assign. So one there. Or you can go like... I think this can go like this. So now, now it's completely shut off. We'll put two. I think we just do that. So you can keep that at four, but this one needs... I want to keep one there so now we have more laborers okay we're good on wood we need we need to start getting some more what's this lacking this is lacking iron see so we're gonna go down here and, and gather some of this iron that's just sitting here on the ground <laughs> so now our laborers are gonna go down there and do that our trees are, are nice and caught up 
Food is good. Maybe I'm gonna get a. We got a two gatherers and two fishermen. No, yeah. Okay, that's good. There we go. Nice. Look at that. Making a bunch of tools. Good, good, good. It's perfect. This is going great, guys. This is really going great. And the next thing, since we've got, now we've got our a hospital, which is broke, broke, broke. That's so good. We are in such a good position right now. So hospital, if there's any disease, you don't, you don't have the hospital on. You don't allocate a physician till there's disease. So you don't, you don't, like I said, you don't need this hospital on until you really need it. Okay. And then what we're going to do is like we got everything we need right now. Maybe we turn on our wood cutter just a little bit, use a little bit of our wood. We need one more house. So maybe we put a house like down here. Okay. Like the road's already in place. I'm going to put a, a house right here. The mine is going. I don't... I truly don't think we have room for a quarry down here. And if we did, it's not reasonable. So, late autumn, early, early winter. So, it's good that we have somebody on, on cutting wood already. Okay. So, now, now that we have two... So now we get really gotta we gotta think about this. So I'm gonna leave a little bit of room behind right here for a road. And we're gonna put we're gonna have we're gonna have to have to put let's see where this ends. I think we're gonna have to put this like right there. I know that's super super bad, but we, we need this quarry. I know we have a lot of stone on the map now, but this is a big, in this is a huge investment right here. Actually, let's pause this and I'm going to put the road. We're actually going to do the road first for this. So we'll do the road there so from there we're gonna go like this and like this and then clear that little mess up okay so now we have our we're making our road out here and I'm actually gonna cancel this but I'm at least gonna get the road built so remove structure. So now it's not there anymore, but the road is. And like I said, we're going to keep removing a bunch of these materials that are still sitting here. All right, guys, it's been an hour. Hopefully you've been enjoying a little banished. Hopefully you can see. These, this this tiny text I turned it up as high as it, it could it could go and uh, we're gonna pause it here and this was the first episode hopefully you guys have been enjoying it uh, until next time this is gambler guys peace